Hi everybody and here is today's Mother's Day 30 days of Mother's Day gift ideas and what we have today is a Mother's Day card on steroids. Um, it is a little card that is made out of envelopes and so I have tied it with a cord because it is chunky so we have a doily on the front and one of those wreaths from the spellbinders die and a bunch of of the flowers including my little fluffy flowers so you open it up and you have cards here to put pictures or remembrances or something that you want to say there's a paper clip here over here there is a pocket with a couple of more cards for you to put um, more memories or something that you want to say to mom. There's also a pocket up here that you can put something in. So have a sticker and some embellishments down here. These are the ribbons that are left over after I made the tassel. And I'll put the tutorial on how you make a, t a tassel. And then I just have this paper mom is attached along with this little heart charm and then a variety of ribbons and cording and embroidery gold embroidery thread so and it's attached um, to a key ring and then onto a paper clip here okay there's also a pocket here that you could put something in there let's see Oop. <laughs> And then we have a flip page and it says remember this so you write a memory there here's some more of those ribbons that were left over and I'll have to go back and fix this because apparently I wasn't all the way dried <laughs> a little sticker that I had in my stash here's a little embellishment that I made with the little cat under the rug and a record player and a coffee cup and it says do all things with love here we have one of the banners that I make, and I'll um, put the tutorial for that below. We have a couple of tags that I added some really neat Paris stickers that my dad had gotten me. And this is a tag that I got in a swap. So you will, if you've swapped with me, you might notice some of the items that, that you gave to me will be showing up in some of the projects because they're all right here by my desk. So this is another car. It says extraordinary every day. I will need to add something there where I just accidentally ripped it. And I added a heart embellishment on the back. And here I have a bookmark. And I'll put the tutorial down below. It is laminated with the packing tape method. And this is actually the bookmark that I made in the tutorial. So I'll place that below as well. So the other thing is um, I will do a tutorial on how I made this envelope flip book. I'll show you really quickly and then I will do a quick tutorial. So again, Mother's Day card on steroids with a key chain. She can actually use this, put it on her purse or hang it somewhere. And um, I have the Happy Mother's Day ripped out. Got a little butterfly here. So, okay. So, how do we make the card? Okay. So, you want three car or three envelopes that are the same size. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the first envelope and you're gonna place it inside. this envelope. So you're going to place it inside like this and seal it. Okay. And that will give you a pocket here. And then you're going to come over. You'll have a pocket here and you go ahead and you seal it here. Now you can use the seal on your envelope, but some of the envelopes that I'm into are actually probably antiques. I got them um, in this huge uh, 
thing of paper and all kinds of things. So I'm going to use my ATG gun and put that one there. And I think I forgot to go across the bottom on that last one. But in the triangle, so I've put the glue in the triangle and I'm going to put it face down inside this pocket here. And there you go. So there is your the body of your Mother's Day card on steroids. Okay, so now what you do is you just cut out papers that are going to be the right size for your envelopes. And I did mine about between a quarter and an eighth, and well, actually probably about a quarter of an inch all the way around. Smaller than the, the other. Um, Had more over here I guess I so now on these ones with the pocket you can cut them so that they open like the pocket does so you can see it you can notch a hole um, with your one inch hole uh, round punch and that way it will actually have the look that you can tell that it's a pocket um, the other thing that I did, like on this one, is attach it so you put your glue in a horseshoe shape, or a U, leaving the top open, and then you have a place to put a tag. Okay? So, um, on this particular one, the tag is in the back. And, um, and then what I did is... I folded over and left about, um, gosh, about, what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, about three-eighths of a gusset so that it will hold the thickness here. And I chose, I didn't want it to come around because I didn't want it to be a part of the front, I, so I had it come into the second. And then I, I had the cord come and tie it around to close it. Also, one of the things I found on my paper was this bo book belongs to and the date. So whoever I give this to, I can I can go ahead and, and do that as well. So that is how I made my Mother's Day card on steroids. And let me just show you really quickly. I have some others that are made up and ready that are other sizes of envelopes. I've done some with color. And these are ready to just be a really fast gift. I can go on, um, you know, say my niece's Facebook page and or her mom's and scrap lift or scrap lift and get some of her photos and put together a really cute, nice little album. You could do the same thing for your mom for Mother's Day. So I hope you enjoyed this Mother's Day card on steroids. And if you get a chance to um, make one, I would love to hear about it. Uh, some of the things that you can put in these pockets is a little tea bag. I had these Hershey's bars. <laughs> I was going to put two of them in here. I ate one. <laughs> so I was going to, um, you know, decorate it nicely and put it on a card and then put it inside. But so you could do those. Um, you could even uh, do either she or her and cover the rest of it. So, um, yeah, so you could do that. Or like the magnet that we that I, um, I made earlier in the week. You could make a magnet and that could go in there. Uh, earrings could go in here, a gift card, all kinds of things. But at the same time, you have a really nice card. So I hope you like this video. If you do, don't forget to like it and find something to celebrate every day. 
don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Oh, and happy National Scrapbooking Day.